both professionals, world class, championship caliber, for it, and that's how I want you to conduct yourself in this ring. That said, Mr. Horn, Mr. Crawford, gentlemen, let's do this. Terrence Bud Crawford. We are underway for the world title fight. Crawford and Horn. And let it be noted, Robert Bird, the third man inside the ropes, the veteran. Distance. Every time Horn steps in, he gets out just far enough, and he tries to counter just like there. Getting after it pretty early here. He lunges in just like that with his head. Oh, Horn comes in with a right hand that lands flush on Crawford. Right hand and caught Crawford bagging out. Like comes there back again. in and there's Crawford that does check that right hand. <laughs> Pretty good looking opening rounds here. Good exchange there as Crawford able to land. Horn had the to carry the weight from lightweight up to welterweight and win a crown. That is what he's trying to do tonight. The American from Omaha. Bud Crawford, round number two. Left hand to the body from Crawford. Undoubtedly a bigger guy. Naturally the bigger man. Not the better athlete, not the more much to go with the reaction time of Crawford. It's a left hand that comes in from... When you're in there, I'd slide around him a little bit more, but you're going chest, body, overhand, you've got a mark on you, it looks no. fantastic, so... Too good. Too good. Telling him how well he did. Russian's an interesting character. Part Tony Robbins, part Chuck no, no, Norris. No. on the relationship of trainer to fighter. That time he came forward and Bud nailed him. Right hook. Charging in with a right hand, and now they exchange in the middle of the ring. That once he counters, Horn steps back with his hands down to try to reset, and he's following him out. All that Bud Crawford overcame to arrive to this mountaintop of a career. There it is. Time. Defensive flaw. Crawford couldn't take advantage, but a left hand hits the mark. And now a pop jab. And a good left hand on a combination. Stage dropping his hands, moving out at distance, close distance, close range. Excellent round from Buck Crawford. And you see the swelling already over the toilet, Adam. How you doing? He's going to slide around it. Pop standing, pulling away. And Terrence is smart enough to follow him and land that one, two. They put a grease on that brow of the right eye. Of Crawford later in the fight. He's, he's, not, he's not working the body. No, 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 no. And if you look at his back, he's a welterweight. Broad and muscular. He also has reach just beyond his measurable height. Another good lead left hand from the Nebraskan. Man, great to have Andre Ward, of course, retired last year. Number one pound for pound fighter in the world when he did Vasily Lomachenko who vie for that title to be called the world's best tonight would be a crowning achievement to become a three division champion if Crawford keeps up like this good start to round him from the outside he wants to stay right in front of him blocking counter block a ninth round as, as Horn did against Pacquiao and with Watch this skill level free, you're out. seeing with, with Bud Crawford now you see why well, Bud Crawford don't want to be here if he's there, he wants to be there. He should be. Horn said, I'll test his soul. I think it's quite the opposite. I think that Crawford is testing Horn's soul. He's pushing him around. Mm -hmm. You can see that redness above the right eye as he sends back Horn. Crawford's in control. Hiding around him right. Up and down. Hitting from all lanes. Over his Changes, he reminds him, when something good happens. That's exactly what happened in the 10th round against Manny Pacquiao yes. when he was almost TKO'd in the ninth. Yes, absolutely. Some See, broken rhythm pressure. Explain that to us. Broken, broken rhythm pressure is based up against the limits of his size and his age. Right now, Horn is coming up, at least against Crawford, the limits of his talent. He's paying a price for it now. He's trying. I mean, he's giving his best best foot forward. Rushton says you just got to land a few shots. It's, it's a lot easier said than done, even on the inside. Good uppercut that time from Bud Crawford. The left hand landed. We're not spotted. Now he's going downstairs. <laughs> that hurt. That hurt. That took the air out of, out of Horn right there. East Bozeman is sitting ringside for this fight on ESPN+. Plus. 
Oh, we have, have the award-winning actor with us, Mark Wahlberg, also here tonight, as is Rick Ross and many NFL stars to come see the great Bud Crawford. Omak just wants parents to keep working that body, wear him down. Thing to happen. Yes. They need that miracle. They need to find that magic that they found somehow late against Pacquiao. But this isn't Manny Pacquiao in the autumn of his career. This is a prime Bud Crawford. They need Terrence to make a mistake. And I don't think that's going to happen. Everything is all set up by the jab from Crawford. Lead left hand from Crawford. And you just said to himself, what is holding this young man up? <laughs> by the way, there was so much made of the judging in the fight against Pacquiao for Jeff Horn. And then there was the review of the scores. Nor is it going to come down to the referee, who's the subject of so much debate. What would Robert do? What would Robert Crawford switch back right-handed? And he did that because he wanted to right, land that place left hands all night long. Now orthodox is Buck Crawford. There is the left hook. And this is where he can be most dangerous, Mark. Crawford will lay on his, see him lay on that left side. Punching between punches and a flush left hand. Shots to the head. Horn is hurt. Body shot. Left hand came just short. Oh, nearly floored him there. Take day. Missed him with his head. Brave. Strike a slate. Relax. Breathe it in. You can't, you've got to stay on the whole time. We're all good. He's good. He's good. Good. He's good. Will he round? see soon be a three division champion? With a round like that in evidence, if you're Glenn Rushton and you love your fighter, how long do you let this thing go on? About boxing, only takes one punch. He has been thoroughly dominated. He has been hurt. He has been outclassed. But all it takes is one go of it. <laughs> and he's still coming forward. Yeah, Crawford knows he's weakening. He's stepping to him. He knows that he doesn't have the power on his punches like he did early in the fight. So now he's stepping to him and he's his corner to at least factor that in. I don't think we're there yet. I, I mean, I get you, but it's I, a consideration. I disagree. Big left hand, right hook, uppercut sends him back. See what Crawford does with it. Here he comes. Backs him up with a left hand again. Horns in the corner. Uppercut lands. Crawford on the attack. That's it. It's over. It's over. We celebrated an under. He is tough for anybody in the welterweight division. We have been blessed on ESPN to watch Vasily Lomachenko. Official. They are ready to party here in Vegas for the kid from the U.S. of A. And now the new undefeated WBO welterweight champion of the world, Terrence.